Today I'm gonna show you how to play Dixie Whiskey by I Hate God, and we're starting right now. What's up everyone, Steve here again from Does It Doom, the YouTube channel where we help you master doom metal guitar tone, technique, and theory all while learning your favorite songs and riffs. So if that sounds like your type of thing, please like this video, subscribe to the channel, and ring that notification bell for more weekly Doom content. So one of the first interesting things about Dixie Whiskey, and I think the entire Dope Sick record in general, although I'm not sure, is that it is tuned to C-sharp standard. I Hate God whenever they play live, and most of their other records are tuned to C standard, but for whatever reason, Dope Sick and Dixie Whiskey in particular is C sharp standard. So we are in C sharp standard today. I'm playing on my first act, single cut, Lola guitar, obviously on a bridge pickup here. And if you've watched any of my other I Hate God lessons, as per usual for Jimmy's tone, we're gonna have the tone knob rolled all the way off and the volume cranked all the way up. For C-sharp standard, I recommend something in the range of 11 to 54 on string gauge, maybe 12 to 56, just depending on how heavy or light you like your strings. And for an amplifier today, we're running an Orange Crush 30RT solid state amplifier. I think a solid state amp is crucial for that I Hate God style tone. And then the final piece to that puzzle is going to be some sort of boost or overdrive. Jimmy uses a Boss SD-1, but in place of that today, we're gonna use a Does It Doom Doomcaster MOSFET Boost. This is a clean boost, so it's not adding any clipping, just ramping up our volume evenly across a wide range of frequencies. You're not gonna be stripping out a bunch of bass or anything uh, to drive the front end of that amplifier a bit harder. And if you wanna get your hands on one of these, they are finally back in stock today on the website, doesitdoom.com. I'll have a link directly below the video. If you wanna get your hands on one, supplies are limited. We actually ran out out of potentiometers, so the batch is a bit smaller than we expected. But if it is sold out, when you get to the site, just sign up for the waiting list and we'll hit you up with an email the next time they become available. And with that, we're gonna get rolling here. As always, you can grab the complete guitar and bass tab for this lesson and every other lesson over at patreon.com slash does it doom. I'll have a link for that as well down in the description but you can get your shit tuned down to C-sharp standard. We're gonna play it like the record, and we're gonna start out with a quick demo, and then we're gonna come back and break it down riff by riff. Check it. Right, guys so C sharp standard tuning here this song actually switches keys the first intro riff is actually part of the second riff but I'll play through it really quick here it is in the key of C sharp minor and it goes like this so sixth and fifth strings on the third and fifth frets Using that pull off and hammer on. Then we get into the first riff, which goes like this. So 
this riff is in the key of F sharp minor or this fifth fret on the sixth string. This open fifth, F sharp minor. Drift is where we switch to the key of C sharp minor. minor scale. We got some vibrato on the sixth string third fret. If you're digging this lesson, remember to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel. And that takes us to the third and final riff. Kind of similar to the first riff, we've got the same rhythmic pattern throughout. We're just using single notes at the start and power chords at the end, root fifth power chords that is. But when Jimmy plays it live, he does a lot of variation in terms of how he applies that. Sometimes it's actually single notes throughout. <laughs> Note the vibrato again on that minor third. Once again, if you've been after a Doomcaster, they are available today in limited quantities over at doesitdoom.com. I'll have a link directly below the video in the description if you want to head on over and check them out. I want to send out a huge thank you to everyone who supports this channel over on Patreon with a very special thank you to all of our Riff Lord and Riff Messiah tier producers. If you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, you can do so by clicking the round subscribe icon. And of course, if you want to see more content just like this, you can click the YouTube video directly below me. So until next time, always remember, Tony Iommi is your friend. <laughs>